What do you do for work? I'm an artist. You're an artist? What kind of art? Intuitional. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean, intuitional? that you just put under this table, sir. What is this hat? Oh, boy. Can I see it? Do you mind? Do you have, do you have lice? Okay, I do. Uh, so, how long have you had this hat? Uh, two months. Two months. Yeah. So what, what, what inspired you to make this big decision? Uh, you know, new school year. Just new school year. Yeah. Oh my god. The, the summer came and went, you're like, fuck, I didn't do anything. I need to do something to stand out, make people think I did something cool. Then you saw it in the window like this, you're like, I got it. 
What are you studying? Archaeology, I hope. <laughs> who is who is this to you? That's my mom. That's your mom. Mom, what do you what do you what did you tell him when you saw it? Put it in the car. Your mom bought it for you too? <laughs> God damn, this hat gets sadder and sadder every moment. <laughs> Keep it? That's how you know how little it costs. <laughs> Are you a Disney adult? No. Yes. yes. <laughs> how deep are you into Disney? My mom's worse. She's 100% worse. <laughs> okay, that's not a good answer, I gotta tell you. That's like if you catch a n***, they're like, you is way worse than me. I'm just a sergeant. Do you have any Disney tattoos? <laughs> yeah. Yes, you do. How many Disney tattoos do you have? Two, okay. You said two like it was a reasonable number. What are the tattoos? I have a Mickey balloon behind my ear and then I have a Tinkerbell in honor of my aunt, so. You have a Tinkerbell in honor of your aunt. Yes. You're about to make it sad, but I'm gonna let it go there. Let's try. She's crazy. So. She's crazy? Yeah, she crazy. I don't know if you get to call someone else crazy when you got a Tinkerbell tattoo of them. I mean, she had a whole, like, bedroom of, like, Tinkerbell stuff. So, like, I'm allowed to say she's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Was it, like, a Tinkerbell-themed funeral? <laughs> no. Like, did everyone try to clap at the funeral to see if maybe she'd come back? <laughs> and people from afar, like, they are applauding at that funeral so hard over there. They must have really hated that bitch. <laughs> We went to high school together. Do you, what, what was your impression of me in high school? Like, was I annoying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, but you're at my fucking show, so I must have been kind of fun in my own way. I was a theater kid, you all knew that. <laughs> did you do any of the, you did some of the shows, right? No. You did none of the shows. <laughs> oh. Well, I don't know how to come back from that. I, uh... <laughs> but you're doing well now. Were there black people in the shows? Um, when I did when I did Little Shop of Horrors, when I did Little Shop of Horrors, there was a black person in the puppet. We did we did a lot of shows at that school that we should not have given that it was a very white cast. We did Pacific Overtures, which was about Japanese people. We did Arabian Nights, which was about not white people. I just I just I thank God every day we never did a raisin in the sun. You have a what? What's a, what's a green card? A baby. When they start to have a kid to convince the government that oh they're really in love. Oh, 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 oh. I thought you just had to be like, you know, you know, what color is their toothbrush? I didn't know you had to literally bring life into this world. When did they tell you that? Or was it like the gender reveal? It was like the cake was green. <laughs> Yeah, I know those days very well. You don't have to tell me about the McDonald's mom telling a secret she shouldn't tell thing. We've all been there, sweetheart. That had to have uh, fucked you up a little bit. I was used to it at that point. He's done so much worse. Oh. What else has he done? So he was mad that my mom was leaving him and taking the kids. Sure, that makes sense. And he tried framing her for battery and robbery. <laughs> 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 Sure. And to this day, my grandparents always think, oh, thank God we got a Jewish lawyer. No. <laughs> no, you're Jewish. You're Jewish. Okay, good. I was like, I was really enjoying it until the anti-Semitic twist at the end. I was like, oh, you poor lady. Oh, fuck you! So I just gave them the show. They asked me, are you really straight? When I said straight, you, you gestured to her. Why? Because uh, I had a conversation today where I just told that I was gay. I was about to ask you that myself. <laughs> do you do theater? I did do theater for a year before going to advertising. One year of theater and you were like, fuck, I just move like this forever now. Where does it come from? Where does this? Because it's the same. I sit like you're sitting right now, just like, I love pussy. What are you talking about? I love pussy. What is it? What do you think? ADHD, probably. ADHD. <laughs> Somewhere, there's some parents bringing their kids to the doctors being like, please tell me it's ADHD. I'm sorry to say, your son 
Loves cock. Loves cock. I don't know, we should, you know, we should hang out after the show, talk about what it's like to be so straight. I just feel like we should talk about what it... Get a room and be like, why don't people believe us? And then we'll whisper in each other's ears, I know you're straight.